Hello everybody and uh, welcome back to another um, Pokemon trading card game pack opening, box opening, whatever. Uh, I'm just by myself today, uh, but me and Anna definitely have a bunch of a uh, bunch of packs to open, a bunch of boxes to open together. Um, but anyway, uh, today I'm opening this box. Uh, Ultra Beasts GX, which uh, is a pretty cool box. I've opened the Buzzwall version of this. Buzzwall, yeah, Buzzwall version of this. Uh, this is the Feromosa version. So there's two versions you can get. And it comes with like a bunch of packs, um, a mat. Uh, this is the Buzzwall mat that it comes with here. So. Um, yeah, a bunch of packs, a couple of promo cards, uh, the mat, the jumbo size card, pretty cool. Just move this out of the way, start going through these things. We've got our Celestilla GX card, as it was focusing on it kind of before. There we go. Okay, no. Still wants to focus on the background. I mean, I know there's a lot going on in the background, but whatever. Pheromosa GX. Got a little Pheromosa coin. It, it 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 does really well at focusing in on it for a second. But I love it. I love these coins. They're not as good as like the one that came in the um XY premium collection box or whatever it was. The metal metal coin, but it's still very nice. Have a stack of packs to open. We'll go through that in a second. Still a, a couple of cool things here. We have the Jumbo Feromosa card, which is pretty cool. I did not have this one yet. And I do like collecting them, so. And then we have our little play mat here. As you can see, is pretty similar to the Buzzwell one that we just had down. But it's got the Feromosa, the Nihiligo, and the Celesteela on it instead of the Zerkatree, the Buzzwell, Guzzlord, and Kartana. But yeah, this is um, my third mat that I've gotten from boxes like this, I think. Uh, and it is extremely cool, in my opinion. Anyway, um, stop messing with the volume levels um, by going back and forth between my boxes and stuff. Uh, and we'll head into uh, having a look at some of these packs and seeing what we can get in. So it looks like we've got uh, Burning Shadows, a couple of Crimson Invasions, we've got Ends Rising. Base set, Sun and Moon, Steam Siege, Patch Collide, and Evolutions. So, some nice variety here. Save all the Sun and Moon ones for last. Something like that. Steam Siege up first. And once again, I'll be giving out code cards for uh, anything higher than a hollow. So we've got one, two, three. We've got our rare, our reverse. Uh, 
Azumarill, Fletchinder, Skiploom, Rufflet, Ponyta, Meowth, Litwick, and Hoppip. Okay. It's messing with the colours again. Excellent. Our reverse holo is a Quartzer. And our rare is a non holo Weavile. Okay. Unfortunate. Potentially the lighting in here that's messing with it a little bit as well. But, I mean, I always have this problem of it not wanting to focus on the cards. Um, Fates Collide up next. And I just don't know what to do. Uh, but I'll figure it out, I guess. One, two, three. Rare, reverse. You got Team Rocket's Handiwork, Weezing, Berry Garden, Meowth, Coughing, Burmy, Bollaby, and Lavatar. Our reverse holo is a Grumpy. I feel like you, I move it, it wants to focus on it, but it doesn't, whatever. And now our rare. Is Mr. Mine. Maybe I just need to bring it closer to the camera. No, it still doesn't want to keep focused on it. Is it the way I'm holding it? I don't know. Is it my fingers? I don't know. Is it the background? I do not know. Alright, next up is Evolutions. One, two, three. To the front. We get our rare, we get our reverse. We got Polywell, Pokedex, Potion, Magnemite, Water Energy, Growlithe, Machop, Voltorb. Reverse Hollow Pokedex, okay, and a rare, a poop rare, dug chair. So, nothing too good out of the pre Sun and Moon packs. So, let's head into the Sun and Moons. Alright, uh, one, two, three, four to the front. That'll be our rare, that'll be our reverse, and we'll have the energy, Dragonair, Polywell, Rushing Hammer, Litten, Firo, Paris, Lillipop, Bound Sweep. Our reverse holo will be Rubombi. Oh, and our rare. Is a poop wreck abominable. So once again, nothing too great there. Guardians Rising next up. Surely we're gonna get at least one good card, right? Whoops, my camera stand there. One, two, three, four. Got our rare, got our reverse. Energy. Alamomola, Marini. Legenda, Trubbish, Jangma-O, Wimpod, Gumi, Wishy Washy. Our Reverse Holo is an Alolan Vulpix, little cute Alolan Vulpix, that's pretty cool. And our Rare is the other Alolan variant, the Alolan Sand Slash. Still cool, but still a poop rare. So, getting quite skunked on all these packs, unfortunately. Nothing too interesting yet. we still got three more packs to hopefully get something in, but we've got uh, Burning Shadows up now, I believe it was. We've got our rare, our reverse, energy, Rotom Dex, 
Escape Rope, Sophocles, Panseer, Cutie Fly, Pan4, Pikachu, and Krogunk. Reverse Holo is a Cutie Fly. Okay. And our rare is a Holo Zygarde. So that's the best that we've got so far. Not 100% skunked. But still. Better than nothing. Better than nothing. Got to keep a positive attitude about these things. One, two, three, four. To the front. Rare. Reverse. Energy. Hakuma O. Diggersby. Peaking Red card. Spoink. Chameko. Chigglypuff. Ex execute and Stuffle. Our reverse holo is. A Pilo Swine. Nice. And our rare is Poop Rare Reggie still. So one hollow so far and that's it. Nothing to get too excited about. Um I believe my Buzzwall uh GX box or like the the Buzzwall version of the Ultra Beast GX box was uh, a fair amount more successful for me, so. But this is the last pack, last Burning Shadows. Uh, one, two, three, four, done to the front. We've got our Revere, our Reverse, and our Energy on top. Um, Piloswine, Diggersby, Hakama O, Cubone, Weedle, Minchino, Fourfish, and Ghastly. Our Reverse Holo is. And a Lowland Geodude. And then our last and final rare, can it be last pack magic, is a Poop Rare Primate. No, it cannot be last pack magic. So, fairly unlucky on this box, unfortunately. Um, I mean, got the Jumbo card, got the promo cards, got the coin. Um... And then our best card was the Zygarde Hollow Rare. So, um, potentially the best thing in this box was the the play mat, which is pretty cool. So, probably not worth the price of the box overall, but I'm not unhappy to get that. I mean, I I like to flesh out my collection of these things sometimes, so. Yeah, um, I'm not going to complain too much. I get to open Pokemon cards and that's uh, half the fun. So uh, thank you all for watching and I will see you all for a, another pack opening video in the future. See you later.